Hai Nepa TV viewers Today we are going to see some interesting topics related with button control Here we are going to see how to generate click event for the button control Let me see how it works I am just opening one test web form so that we can place the button and we can see how it works the event control the button event handler is used to place or transfer the value from client side to server side let me see how it works you can easily understand what the things is going on here i am just deleting the previous things I am just adding one ASP control button in dot ASPX page that is front end page this is a HTML page it is in the format of dot ASPX dot ASPX is a server side control we can handle here by using the inherit option so let me see you can add this button control through you can drag and drop from the text box also sorry my system is little bit slow please be patient to watch yeah now i am adding the text for the button to call up the button something called summit or yeah here we i am just using the summit for our reference this is the text for that that uh, title which is going to be displayed on the button properties I am just getting these properties for button yeah you can easily understand uh, you just double click this button um, it will generate the on click event this is a click event which is generating by automatically uh, you can add by through properties events also I am just deleting these things before that I will show you clearly what is the things ok there is one lightning symbol that uh, you can find this that, that is a called click ok if you double click on this uh, properties lightning events you can um, get this event generated automatically in that C sharp file that is a CS file backend file here I am just using the response dot right to write something it will be throw this in the client side if this a button even click it will uh, throw what other things in this method let me see how it works
I am just running this application. Oops, some issue with my Visual Studio, that's why it's getting so late. Actually, I think it's loading uh, all the DLL files. We will talk about the .dll files later videos. Here I shown you throw a at, throw attribute. Attribute is nothing but uh, we are adding right on click on click event. It is actually uh, it's creating that event handler. Now we going to see through using the delicate control in server side. We can use the delicate method also to handle this event handler. That means that click event we can handle through in the server server control. We can add these things in page load. It will work. I'm just giving you. First, I need to create one instance for this. So. I am just uh, taking this ID as a button one, so um, button one dot. You can get this everything here. We, uh, button dot click. Sorry, I actually I given this on client click. Actually, one more thing is also there on client click that I will show you in later videos. Mm, here on button click, there is one event. Event you can find out in that lightning symbol. Okay dot click equal to i am creating one new instance for this new i am just adding the new event handler because this is a click events is comes with the event handler here in this bracket you need to pause this method name why we are going we are creating the event handler is to get uh, that event must be handled by shishop so this is on default uh, um, namespace which is added in the visual studio we can we pause this method into the event handler it will access ev everywhere okay and before that you need to learn um, this plus why we are adding this plus because on click event we are adding the n number of methods we can add so we need to add a plus equal to we can get this if you have any doubt uh, i will clarify you in this by uh, next or uh, next to that video i'm just 
running this application. Yeah, it's loading now. Now I am clicking submit. Uh, it's, yeah, now it's working because um, because uh, we are adding this instance for event handler to this method, so it's working in dot aspects. That means the HTML page also there is no event. We are not called any attribute like on click. We can handle this event control through server side also. There is two kind of method we can use this the thing you need to be learn for click event control for the button likewise we are adding uh, we are adding this click event throw attribute and the delegates thanks for watching guys please subscribe for more videos